Hi, I'm Jennifer Perez from mysticandnailspr.com and you're on my Zen Fresh channel. Okay, so let's get into the goodie stuff. This type of healthy eating is safe for you, for any other person, for a child or even a mother to be pregnant. <laughs> pregnant as can be. You get to eat delicious foods. You are not going to starve. The ticket here is to eat a whole base plant diet, which are veggies and fruits. Now, I don't like to call it a diet because it is a lifestyle, a healthy lifestyle, a healthy lifestyle that you are embracing. I embraced it. And if you want to go ahead and embrace it, go ahead and do that too. You can choose a variety of whole base plant-based foods vegetables and fruits. Now here's the secret. You cannot eat, well you shouldn't, eat meat, poultry, fish, anything that's animal related, eggs, and well, dairy. Yes, all of them. What? You're hooked on ice cream? I was too, but just substitute it. Don't eat a cow's milk dairy ice cream. Just substitute it for some other ingredients. Make some fresh frappes or smoothies or even make um, ice cream made out of home natural based ingredients with fruits. They taste delicious. Some people are, are allergic to meat and dairy products. I found out that I was allergic to dairy products because Dairy tends to be like a inflammatory, so it didn't go good. There are a lot of people that, that are allergic. The percentage is really high because animal protein is not compatible with a human DNA. I'm one of those people. I found this out during these three months of experimenting and my allergies are totally gone. I found out that I was allergic to dairy products. Arthritis, I did tend to get an x-ray and they told me I had arthritis on my back. And what is arthritis? It's when that area swells up and you can't move correctly. And since it was on my spine, I couldn't feel my legs. I had pain in my legs the whole time. It was very uncomfortable. And nowadays, I don't have it no more. Dairy and animal products are not healthy. They promote cancer. They promote different diseases such as diabetes, high blood pressure, allergies like the ones I had, and various other diseases you can name. Now you can google this stuff up and find more information. Those are one of the reasons that I chose to embrace this kind of healthy eating lifestyle. And one of the chronic diseases that nobody wants is cancer. So if you're afraid of it, just cut it out of your lifestyle. And by all means, always be positive. Don't complain. Just say prayers. Give blessings. And you'll see you will make it through this. If you need any help, you know where you can find me. You can go to our support group. I will leave you a link down below. It's easier when you have a buddy that's doing these same kind of eating habits as you. There's many people that are going to contradict this kind of lifestyle. You do what you desire and what you learn from this. Just do the experiment for one month. You'll see the benefits in one week and you're not gonna want to leave this. Like if you're gonna drool over a burger, you can do a burger but based on natural ingredients. Now I don't like to buy Let's say chili. I don't like to buy like a vegetarian can of chili because one, they have preservatives in there. They, it's in a, a can. Cans are not good. Same ingredients, you can make it on your own on your stovetop. I'll try to show you guys how to make a chili though. But remember, dairy is a pro-inflammatory. There are various ingredients you need to watch out for, at, such as casein. Casein is from animal protein. You need to watch out for lard. Lard is from, let's say, the fatty stuff from pigs. 
vegetable oil don't use vegetable oil color dyes color dye is extracted from beetles which is from animals if you want to use oil go ahead and use an extra virgin olive oil which is cold pressed and usually when you say cold pressed or extra virgin it's because it's from the first extract from the olives not from the second and the third which tends to like let's say liquefy and all your proteins or vitamins are going down the drain so use extra virgin olive oil or you can even use grapeseed oil now if we were to categorize this kind of healthy lifestyle you know there's carnivorous there's from the from the animals there's vegetarians and vegetarians is broken down into these other small segments so this type of eating would be called or categorized in vegan veganism vegans do not eat meat poultry fish anything that's animal related such as eggs and dairy products don't eat jello it might seem it doesn't have anything that has animal but it actually does the jello is extracted from bones and some other gooey gross stuff from all the animals from cows and pigs etc the other thing you need to cut out of your healthy eating lifestyle is refined products such as white sugar white flowers some cereals white sugar usually has bone char and bone char is from where from cows mm -hmm. what about wine and beers and stuff like that well the wine some of them have extracts from fish read your ingredients that are available on your packaging. If it says sugar, watch out, don't eat it. Just use a turbinated sugar. Another pro or a plus or a bonus for being a healthy lifestyle eater is you're helping the environment and you are being kind to animals. So you're not doing any cruelty or being accomplice of killing any other animals in the process to be packaged and sold in markets. Now I will get into details and give you some more hints and tips and suggestions during other videos because I don't want this video to be like really super long. Eating healthy is a good thing but if you overeat specific things you will gain weight and if you don't want that eat in moderation and also you don't want to hire or peak your different levels that have to do with like proteins and stuff like that. And trust me, you do get to eat delicious foods. You can check all these dishes that I've made throughout the, the month. You should eat in moderation. Be positive. If you need a support buddy, you know where you can find me. Or you can join our support group. You can find the link down below in the description box. And I will see you soon. So remember to eat in moderation, go down that correct path positively, don't complain, do your prayers, do some blessings for you, for others, and always be happy, healthy, sexy, yeah, and feel the love, embrace it, and share it. So you guys, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, share it with two of your friends, Subscribe to the channel and I will see you on Facebook at Zen Fresh. Take care and have a great day. Ciao.